Nancy Blum, 28th Street Subway Mosaics, presented by Carol Bowen. We're headed to 23rd Street to see the new mosaics by Nancy Blum and Myoto Mosaics. I lived in this neighborhood for over 20 years, and this was one of the gloomiest stations in town. Thanks to a renovation and the beautiful art of Nancy Blum and Myoto Mosaics, it's now transformed into one of the loveliest. In addition to adding new mosaics, much attention and respect was paid to keeping the old mosaics. Those once dingy borders on the wall are now fresh, glittering gold. From a dark and dingy tunnel, this has become a light, airy bower of flowers. You can see that the old mosaics are respected and integrated into the new design. Seven types of flowers that grow in nearby Madison Square Park are depicted in the mosaics. Blum said she was inspired by 17th century German botanical illustrations, such as this one by Johann Jakob Walter. Blum was also inspired by Chinese paintings like this 17th century Wen Ji. These are not delicate blooms. They're strong and assertive natural forms rendered in powerful, expressive lines. Myoto Mosaics did a magnificent job Notice the subtle gradations within each line. The lines are multicolored and change gradually from dark to light, from thick to thin. The bolder outlines consist of red, brown, and black. The flow of the tiles in the background is called the andamento, Small gold tiles are interspersed among the white tiles. The lines sculpt the surface of the forms with energy and gesture. Notice how in the background every form is surrounded by a single row of white tiles, giving a nice transition between the objects and the background. Blum's use of strong, expressive contour lines reminds me of Van Gogh's paintings. In this Van Gogh painting of irises, you can see a strong, expressive outline. Notice in Blum's flowers how the line models the branches in a similar way to Van Gogh's branches. These are not sweet, insipid flowers. They are robust, fertile, growing plants. The colors harmonize with the color scheme of the existing mosaics. Old and new are intertwined. Perennials are plants that bloom every year. The flowers here are all perennials from nearby Madison Square Park. These mosaics give us the sense that spring is just about to burst in, no matter what the weather is outside. The flowers seem to grow around the walls, wrapping themselves around the corners. Every blossom, bud, and leaf shows beautiful gradations of color and tone. The material is hand-cut smalty glass. Nancy Blum, Roaming Underfoot. Myoto Mosaic Art Studios for the Fabricators. Please hit like and subscribe for more Subway Mosaic video tours.